no who would want to look like that ever yeah think about the simple daily things getting in and out of a car um going upstairs in the event you get on an airplane it's just i don't know I, i almost feel bad for them and i i feel bad for their families and you know the possibility god forbid but like there's so many guys dying oh yeah so many guys dying and it's um i heard of another one this week that was a 90s bodybuilder died i can't remember the name but it's unfortunate you know it's just you go to these expos and it's a health and fitness expo but we just kind of conveniently pretend that everyone's healthy and reality is (laughs) you know (laughs) Yeah, I mean, yeah, exactly. That's what it's supposed to be about. But exactly what you just said it is not. I mean, when you're taking, I think insulin is probably what ruined the sport, personally, because yeah. I think that's what's made them so blown up. They're so, they look like balloons almost now. They're so, so big. Because uh, they didn't look like that. Like when Arnold was competing and Frank Zane and Tom Platts, they didn't have that look at all. They were very defined. Yeah, they had a hard look that you don't see today. Yeah. Yeah. And, yeah, I mean. I think the big difference is insulin and growth hormone. Yeah. yeah. Where it changed, you know, it started going in a different (laughs) different direction. Absolutely. Absolutely. So you train full body? I try to. That that is my philosophy. Uh, 